now let's see how to write embedded c program for serial communication so open your kill microvision and select project tab and from this choose the option new project and give your project name as serial communication click on save and this is the window for choosing the device from different manufacturers from this select atmel manufacturer and click on plus mark it will show the list of devices from this manufacturer and select the device which is 8089C51 click on ok and now so if you want to add startup file for your project click on yes otherwise no now our people created a project with a specific target device which is 8089C51 now open your editor window to write the program further select file tab and choose option new and uh, before writing your program try to save this and give your program name as with node c extension this is compulsory because you are going to write the program in c language now so write down your statements of embedded C program one by one and this is the header file name and from here main starts for establishing serial communication you have to follow the steps which is SCON register SCON register value as 0x50 and you have to choose the timer 1 in mode 1 mode 2 for that you had to use t mode register and the value is 0x20 and you have to set the baud rate by using formula th1 is equal to minus x and this stands for baud rate as 9600 and start your timer and whatever the character you want to transmit keep with your sbuf register the single quote which will make a character as a constant and wait until 
transmission is over so for that there is a ti bit here you see the status of transmission completion which is ti so this ti status will become 1 after completion of transmission just make 0 for next character transmission uh, this is the program for one character transmission with 9600 baud rate from microcontroller to external device so if you want to see the output of this program just save this and if you want to compile this program select target option from project workspace window and click on this plus mark you will get source group 1 and just right click on the source group 1 you will get option add files to source group 1 and which program you want to compile select the file and click on add and you have to verify whether errors and warnings with your program for that go project app and build target it will show the errors and warnings present with the program and just choose target one option from project workspace window and right click it you have to choose the option options for target target one <coughs> and give the oscillator frequency as <coughs> 11.0592 and highlight the option use on chip prop In the same window, select output tab and highlight the option create hex file and click on OK. So after giving all these options, save this file and build it once. So it will show the hex file path and just go for debug session you can see the output of this program and click on the option start or stop debug session and to open your serial window there is an option for you view and click on serial window so now go debug tab and choose the option run so which is continuously transmitting the character i from controller to external device and if you want to see the same response from hardware circuit by using simulation tool which is produce go for debug tab and stop running and stop debug session now minimize your key and open your produce simulation tool and here you have to pick the device from library which is 889C51 and go for instrument mode from here 
choose virtual terminal which is help us to see the serial communication applications now do the cross connection the rxt line of virtual terminal we have to connect with txd and this just make the cross connection with this rxd with txd here and do this rxd connection with txd so after connecting your connection of your to virtual terminal with your controller double click on controller it will ask for program file path and click on folder symbol so and click on the serial communication and give the symbol open and apply your clock frequency as 11.0592 click on okay <clears throat> and to see the hardware response click on play so which is keep on transmitting your characters from microcontroller to peripheral device with 9600 and bot it so this is a way you can test your serial communication applications with controller by using keel and produce combination thank you